To solve this quadratic equation, let's first factor the left side of the equation. So, to transform the equation into the form of x plus m times x plus n equals 0, we must find the values of m and n. But we know m plus n is 2, and m times n is minus 8. So, our goal is to find two numbers that add to 2 and multiply to minus 8. First, let's think about all the combinations of two numbers that multiply to minus 8. 1 times minus 8 is minus 8. Minus 1 times 8 is minus 8. 2 times minus 4 is minus 8. And, minus 2 times 4 is also minus 8. Now, let's see which of these combinations adds to 2. 1 plus minus 8 is minus 7, so 1 and minus 8 do not add to 2. Minus 1 plus 8 is 7, so minus 1 and 8 do not add to 2. 2 plus minus 4 is minus 2, so 2 and minus 4 do not add to 2. Now, minus 2 plus 4 is 2. So, minus 2 and 4 not only multiply to minus 8, but also add to 2. This means m and n are minus 2 and 4. Now, this equation tells us that the product of x minus 2 and x plus 4 is 0. So, to make the equation true, at least either x minus 2 or x plus 4 must be 0. Now, we are going to solve each of these equations. First, let's solve x minus 2 equals 0. The solution is x equals 2. Then, let's solve x plus 4 equals 0. The solution is x equals minus 4. So, the solutions to the quadratic equation are x equals 2 and x equals minus 4.